Italian police have recovered two Van Gogh paintings stolen during a dramatic raid on an Amsterdam museum in 2002, and the works were recovered from the Naples Mafia. The Van Gogh Museum in Amsterdam said the works were found during a massive continuing investigation by Italian prosecutors and organized crime officials. The paintings were taken when thieves used a ladder and sledgehammers to break into the museum. They were eventually found wrapped in cloth in a safe house. The works were among assets worth millions of euros seized from a Camorra organized crime group linked to cocaine trafficking. Months earlier, police had arrested several suspected drug traffickers that were reportedly linked to one of the biggest mafia clans in the Scampia area of northern Naples. Among those arrested in January were suspected drug and gang leader Raffaele Imperiali and Mario Cerrone. It was Mr. Cerrone who apparently told investigators about the two paintings. The theft of the works, valued by investigators at $100 million, led to criticism of security of the world's major museums. The museum said it was so far unclear when the works would be returned to Amsterdam, but in a statement they had appeared to be in relatively good condition. Dutch and Italian ministers were overjoyed by the news and praised Italian investigators.